Welcome to White Lecture Online. In this video, we're going to take the equation of a plane. It's the general form of the equation, except we have the 4 on the right side of the equal sign instead of minus 4 on the left side. But we're going to use that equation to find three points on that plane. Then in the next video, we're going to take those three points to see if we can get the original equation back so you can see how this works. So again, what we need to do is we need to take two of the three variables, x, y, and z, assign values to them, and then solve for the third variable, and that's how we find the points. And again, like I said, we're going to take those three points and see if we can get the original equation back using the technique that we learned in the previous video. So let's start with uh, letting. So let x equals 1 and y equals negative 2. So let's find our first point by doing so. So in this case, to find point 1, we're going to do this 3 times x, which is 1, minus 2 times y, which is negative 2, plus z equals 4. So here we get 3 minus times a minus, that's plus 4, plus z equals 4. So z equals 4 minus 7, which is equal to a minus 3. So since z is equal to minus 3, we have our first point. We can say that point 1 is going to be equal to, we have x, 1, y, negative 2, and z, negative 3. So there's our first point on the plane. Now, let's see here. Let x equals 4 and y equals 5, and then we do it again for a second point. So for point 2, we take 3 times x, which is 4, minus 2 times y, which is 5, plus z equals 4. And again, we solve for z, so they get 12 minus 10 plus z equals 4. 12 minus 10 is 2, bring it to the other side, we get z is equal to 2. So, that means our second point, point 2, is equal to 4, 5, and 2 for the coordinates. Now we try our third point for point 3. And let's see here. So let, um, let x equals negative 3 and let uh, y equals, hmm, how about positive 2? All right, that works. So let's plug those in and see what we get. So we have uh, 3 times x, which is negative 3, and um, minus 2 times y, which is a positive 2, plus z is equal to 4, which means that negative 9 minus 4 plus z equals 4. So that's 13 plus 4, that means z equals 17. There's the third value. So to find the third point, point 3, that will give us the coordinates negative 3, 2 for y, and 17 for z. Let's make that a better 3 there. Okay, so now we have three points. There's point 3. There's point 2, and there is point 1. And so, if these are correct, what we can then do, we can take those three points, and we're going to do that in the next video, and turn that back into an equation to see if that we can go back and forth from an equation. We can get three points from three points. We get back the equation of a plane, and that is how it's done. Let me see if these points are correct. 1, negative 2, negative 3, 4, 5, 2, negative 3, 2, and 70. All right, 